hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl laurina <laughs> and in today's video we are going to be doing this hair tutorial i don't know what i'm gonna call it yet but it's probably gonna be like um twist out on natural hair with somebody something like that girl uh this hairstyle is extremely simple super quick and by quick i mean like you know how normally twist takes forever i swear i promise this hairstyle is super quick super simple um and super easy to do so i hope you guys like the video don't forget to comment down below with your thoughts on whether you will be trying out this um hairstyle and if you do please come back and comment and tell me how the process was because <laughs> <laughs> uh don't forget to like this video and yeah let's get into it alrighty let's get started so it goes without saying that you need um clean washed hydrated moisturized hair to start with um that's exactly what i had done i think it was the night before or the night before the night before or something girl i don't know all i know is my hair was clean it was hydrated it was ready to go <laughs> i used molly braid for this hair i literally thought i was gonna need um three packets but i ended up needing not even one less than one and i guess it's because i cut the molly braid i used the color 1b um i always used to wonder what the difference is between one and one b my research tells me girl that one b is a natural black hair color and then color number one is like what your hair looks like when you dye it black so if you're the sort of person that has dyed your hair black and you wanted to match and i would recommend color number one but if you're the sort of person who has naturally black hair then i would recommend color number one b as you can see there the molly braid comes in strands hallelujah it makes it super easy to um figure out how much you need per braid so if you want thicker braids then you can use two strands or whatever i used one strand per every braid so i cut the molly braid so each molly braid was long too long i cut the molly braid in a half and then as i showed you the one half will you'll have to fray it out for fishtail and then the second half is already like pre-twisted in the pack so you can either cut that off or you can undo it with your comb i'll show you later on in this video um and then you start twisting the twisting method that i used for this hairstyle especially because i wanted it to look natural i wanted it to look like my hair I used the method where you part your hair in two and then you start twisting like that's it. You don't do like um, a three strand braid before you start. You literally just part your hair and start twisting your hair as if you're just twisting your own hair. Um, I did not use rubber bands for this method. It was... I wanted it to look not messy chic, but just like if I had twisted out my own hair. You know what I mean? I tried to do, uh, I think it's called like beehive parting. Eee, why am I saying that? I don't know that. I don't know what parting this is called. <laughs> I call it beehive parting. <laughs> I tried to do um, the like little semicolon, semicolon, half moon parting. Okay, girl, but that failed at some point. Um, so this is just me fraying the hair on the one side so that it's frayed out. And then on the other side, I am just using my comb to undo that hair because the um, the dangers in cutting off the other side of the hair is that you make you end up making the hair short so you end up having like uneven hair throughout your head so you can choose whichever method at some points i was cutting it at some point i was undoing it i really didn't care because this hairstyle is just meant to look like i twisted up my own natural hair and put it up i've actually had somebody already like touch my hair to feel whether it's my real hair or whether it's extensions and they weren't able to tell that i have extensions in my hair so i achieved the goal of this hairstyle i would recommend that the one thing maybe that you need to keep alert of is um your partings because my partings were just all over the place child and i think it's also because i started from the back the back i think was nice like i was even using a mirror for the back I, i've never used a mirror for the back of my head but for the back i was even using a mirror i was focused i was dedicated but by the time i got to the front i was like nah fam no way i'm not doing this <laughs> 
no um yeah but that's all i did oh and then i used um i'll show you the styling gel that i used in order to get a good grip and also make sure that all my hair is gripped and that's the hairstyle girl that is literally it depending on how you wear it it really does look like it's hair that is coming out of your head i wanted it to be a bob but i didn't realize just how long my hair had become so the bob thing failed because my hair is literally at like an awkward awkward length stage it's roughly the length of these braids that i have on but yeah that's the hairstyle girl let me know how you feel <laughs> bling bling what was that <laughs> And that's it you guys as i said this hairstyle is extremely simple um right now i haven't put i don't know whether i mentioned in the um, voiceover because i think that's what i'm going to do with this video i haven't put this hair in um hot water yet i think i'm going to do that just now and there are some ends that need to be fixed or whatever but the the basic idea or the look that i wanted to go with with these twist outs is like a normal like your natural hair twist it out you know what i mean you know what i mean you know what i mean exactly <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe um so you can get notified no you need to turn on the bell don't forget to subscribe turn on the bell so you can get notified about future hair tutorials if there are ever any hairstyles that you want me to try out or that you want me to simplify or that you want me to put up on my channel and explain in uh greater detail please tag me tag me on instagram twitter send me a link to youtube videos i would really appreciate the help i hope you guys enjoyed this video once again i will see you in another one